Hi guys, it's Evan from Evan's Way HD, and we're finally back with another Lego movie set. This time it's Penny Spaceship, Spaceship, Spaceship! This is set 70816, 940 pieces, and it's recommended for ages 9 to 14. If you saw my Christmas video on Evan to Barah, you know this is one of the Christmas gifts I got this year. Looks like you get two vehicles. In this set, you get five minifigures. Robo Emmett, Astro Kitty, Benny, Space Wild Style, and Robo Pilot. Okay, let's take a look at the back here. On the bottom, it demonstrates the play features. Okay, let's take a look inside. We get bag number two, bag number six, bag number four, bag number seven, bag number three, instruction booklet and stickers, bag number five, and last but not least, bag number one. You know what time it is. So here we have the completed Benny Spaceship Spaceship Spaceship! Okay, so let's start off with the minifigures. First up, we have Robo Emmett. This is Emmett covered in tin foil. You can kind of see his yellow skin under the metal. Even a piece of resistance is gray. He's got the same orange and blue uniform, except this time he has gray hands. And he comes with a red coffee mug and a red hard hat. Just like the other Emmett's, his hair is attached to his hat. He only has one face, but on the back there's a metallic design. Next up, we have Space Wild Style. She's got the same wild style head. She has two faces, a calm face and a mad face. She has her multicolored hair, and she has a blue space suit on. Next, we have Astro Kitty. This is the same design as the other Uni Kitties, except this one is blue and gold. The headpiece looks like she has a space helmet on, and she's got a little gold horn on the top. Unikitties look cute, but their heads fall off easily. Next up, we have a Robo Pilot. This guy comes with a big laser blaster, and he has a matching helmet and visor. You can move the visor up and down, and you can remove his helmet. He's got some cool printing on the front. It looks like he's wearing a suit with mechanical parts, and there's a little Octane logo on it. It's also got some cool printing on the back. And finally, we have the commander of the ship, Benny! This guy looks the same as the Benny from the Sea Cow. He's got the blue space uniform with the faded printing and the blue space pack. He also comes with a radio. He has two faces, a happy face and an even happier face. Okay, so those were the minifigures and now on to the spaceship. And here it is. Here's the view from a bunch of different angles. This thing has a lot of cool play features. It looks just like the one in the movie. Benny's spaceship measures over four inches high 20 inches long and 16 inches wide. There's a lot of stickers that say LL929, and that represents an old Lego space set. There's also stickers that say Latch. Up on the front, we have some flick fire missiles. They're located right in front of the cockpit area, and let's watch them go. Right here, we have the cockpit. It just hinges open like this. Inside, there's seats for three minifigures. There's a green and red light in the front as well as some control panels. There's also some more controls located on the side. Let's put these guys in here. There's enough room for Benny's space pack and Emmett's piece of resistance. And the hatch just closes like this. Right here we have the air intake. There's a bunch of hoses on each side. And there's some more missiles on the top here. To fire it, all you have to do is press the back of each missile. These are a lot stronger and faster than flick fire missiles. And there's a little area on the top where you could put Astro Kitty. There's also some gauges and a control panel for her. Another cool thing about this is that this area is also a hatch. Once you open it up, it reveals another control center. There's a couple seats here. There's a couple computer monitors. 
There's also a reactor core with a thermostat that can also monitor the temperature. Right here on the back, they have more of the engine. This thing comes up to reveal a satellite dish. And inside, we see more of the mechanics. There's actually two little droids, and you can take them out like this. One is yellow and one is red. There's also some red lightsaber pieces in there. And I guess that's kind of like an energy bar. So you just put the droids back in like this, and then you close off the top. There's also some cannons above the wings, but they don't shoot, they're just there for decorations. The coolest play feature of this set is that the wings can expand. It reveals hidden spring-loaded space cannons. To shoot it, all you have to do is push down on this little yellow piece. Hiya! Back here we have a triple exhaust booster. All you have to do to extend the wings is push the middle exhaust booster. There's some space printing on these pieces back here. There's also some missiles on the end of each wing that don't fire. Cool thing is you can detach these little ships to make little scout ships. Let's do it. Each of these little ships has a rocket exhaust. All you have to do is fold down the wing, bring up the hat, and put in your minifigure. On the front, there's a little target screen that the figure will look through. But there's nothing really protecting them from the space environment. Wee! This is fun! Uh-oh, I knew I should have brought my space helmet. I'm going down! Ah! In this set, you also get the Robo Police Inceptor. It's got some laser cannons on here, but they don't fire. We also have some exhaust boosters on the back. And this has an opening cockpit so you can put a minifigure in it. You have to lean him back a little bit so his head doesn't hit the roof. So that was Benny's Spaceship, Spaceship, Spaceship. It was a really cool set, and if you want to see more LEGO Movie, leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Click on one of these to see more LEGO Movie action.